Well, it's not often that you can bring together an astronaut, a curler, a rower, and a senator to play golf on one day, but that's what's been accomplished here at the Women's Celebrity Invitational. It's a wonderful new tournament that was the brainchild of two legends of the game, Sandra Post and Marlene Street. The prestigious Magna Golf Club in Aurora, Ontario played host to the inaugural Women's Celebrity Golf Invitational, an event featuring a number of the brightest icons in Canadian sports, business and entertainment. The Olympians in attendance all boast impressive resumes filled with athletic achievements, but we wanted to know, are there any similarities between their sport and golf? Oh, for sure. Um, you know, putting is kind of like draw weight and feel and chipping. So I think there is. I'm much better at the on ice sport than I am on the green sport. <laughs> and I can tend to holler, hurry hard out there and try to get it a little closer to the hole. There's something called a hockey swing when you're playing golf. And I'm pretty sure I've got a lot of that. So I guess hockey players are known to just grip it and rip it. And there are players that have soft hands and are good with finesse in, in the short game around the green. But for the for the most part, I'm out here just to, to have fun and, and swing a club and enjoy the weather and, and the golf course. Well, rowing to golf, obviously there's strokes taken um, and there's uh, water. In my sport, it's not a hazard. It's good to be in the water. Um, in my sport, you take lots of strokes quickly. Again, not so good in golf, um, but it's, it's outside and it's with great people. Despite their medals, awards and accolades, all of these women recognize the need to reciprocate the support given to them. This charity function is one of many that fill up their yearly schedules. You know, it was one of the things after Vancouver and winning the medal that we said we weren't just going to leave the medal hanging on a wall. We were actually going to do something with it worthwhile. And so I think it's a responsibility to help raise awareness and, and especially for some of the things that mean a lot. I feel like with events like this being invited out, it's almost impossible to say no, um, especially if it's a golf game or even a hockey event. And Everybody's out here having a good time. It's tough to see. I would like you to find one person not smiling. So um, at the end of the day, that's what we hope is to just bring smile to faces and, and, and help everybody out. You know, I, I'm actually not financially in a position to contribute, but um, I have time and I have stories to tell. And what we want is when people that come to, they come to events, golf events like this, is for them to think they had a great day, um, they had fun, maybe they learned something and they can go home with some stories. And in the whole picture of that, there's this great karma that they gave back. And here today, they're giving back to the Sick Kids Transplant Center. A wonderful cause that hits close to home for Katie Sutherland, who overcame an unbelievable battle of her own. About four years ago, um, I became very ill with a terminal lung disease and I had a successful double lung transplant at the Hospital for Sick Children. So it is a very amazing place. Basically owe my health and everything to them. Um, yeah, they're a really great hospital, great staff. With $413 million generated through charity events like this one every year in Canada, it's the organizers that deserve most of the thanks. And here at Magna, that honor goes to two legends of Canadian golf. Well, I think the game of golf gives back. I think we give back every week on the PGA Tour and the LPGA Tour. So when I was 19 and I joined the tour, it was just sort of, you, sort of, you, you do it every Wednesday, every pro-am, you're always raising money and awareness uh, to charities. And uh, golf is about giving back. It's, uh, it's a kind sport, it's a social sport. It can be anything you want it to be. And um, that's what we're doing here today for, for Sick Kids uh, Transplant Research. From two past stars to a current one, this event brought LPGA Tour player Morgan Pressel to Canada as well. Pressel, who appears at 10 to 15 charity outings every year, has no problem finding the time. It's kind of our job, not just to play golf from you know, Thursday through Sunday, but to, to use our, our platform to help raise money for, for causes that, that are important to us and to our friends. And golf gives you that opportunity to really enjoy a full day um, we bring professionals. I mean, everybody plays golf. Look at all the athletes, the Canadian athletes that are here today that all are out here playing golf. And um, so it's got that unique appeal to bring everybody together and um, it's an easy way to raise money for, for a great cause.